Now, where would we find this glow fruit? Good morning, Mrs. Magda. Do you know if there's any glow fruit growing nearby? Miss June thought you might. They used to grow by the lake, but I haven't seen one in ages. The seed you planted for Wilhelm. It was glow fruit. I'm sorry, dear. If you find one, let me know. They're beautiful, glowing purple and orange. And they only bloom every ten years or so. Really lovely. Thank you, Mrs. Magda. That's just what I need. There's the tree I planted, but the fruit is going to take forever to grow. Then perhaps we should skip ahead. Or rather, I will. Here it is. Now to bring it back to Crispell. You did it! It's not much, though. It will have to do. Let us go see the apothecary. Time to take this fruit... Fruit. Will one be enough? That will do. Give me just a minute. Here you go. There's enough only for one dose, but it's free of charge. Thank you. Well, I finally have the green leaf tonic. I thought you would be happier. What is it, Chris Bell? There's only enough to fix one house. What can I do? Ah, yes. Even with the crystals, there's only so much you can do to help. It appears you must make a decision. How, oh, Matthias? No matter what I choose, one of the houses will be ruined. You are a time mage, Crispell. Decisions such as this, they will not be uncommon. Ashblight? Why would you think that? I overheard the carpenter talking. He thinks a number of buildings could be affected. How awful. I remember my father telling me stories about Ashblight. He said it came from a spore that grew near the farms. That it spread on the wind after the big fires. Well, no time to waste. We don't have much green leaf tonic, but perhaps I can find another solution. Thank you again, Chris Bell. You're welcome, June. I'm glad I was able to help someone. Chris Bell, look! Do you see how your actions have affected the future? I suppose. But what about the Millers? Where will they live? One problem at a time, little one. Remember, most of the town remains unchanged. And we're no closer to finding out what happens to the orphanage. We have more immediate issues to deal with. Look! Smoke! The farms are on fire! That's what brought Ashblade to Nareem the last time! We've got to go! Crispell, wait! I need to get to the fo-
It can't be too late. It can't be. Crispell, get out of here. It's goblins. They've torched the fields. Rungo, there's nothing you can do here. I can help. Just let me. Don't be foolish. Let the soldiers do their work. And pray they're up to the task. He is right, Crispell. The crystals won't be enough. Quickly, we must see Wilhelm again. Again? What is it now, Time Age? Goblins are attacking the farms. We've got to do something. Matthias said you could help. Did he? He's right, I suppose. With your talent and my training, perhaps in a few years. Years? The goblins are attacking now! Patience! You're a Time Mage. Try. We are out of options. There is no other choice. Give her the sword, Wilhelm. Ridiculous! The sword is much too powerful for a novice. The strain would be too much. It is the only way. We have no time to spare. Fine. If the girl is everything you believe, she may well survive. It doesn't matter. I'll do it. Very well. This should be interesting. <laughs> Just in time. Quickly, Crispell, the goblins. But Mother Superior, my friends, I have to protect them. Go. I'll look after them. Meet us at the cathedral. We'll be safe here. Now go. Thank you, Wilhelm. They're trying to reach the town. Now that you have the sword, your powers have been enhanced. You should now be able to send your enemies to either the future or the past. Give it a try. supposed to be hello my name is tell me if we survive let us show him not bad no christopher but chris bell It's two less of them. I've been chasing those things since I left St. Clarity. We've got to stop them before they reach town. And exactly how do you plan to do- Hold your ground! They won't get past us! Look, Volcano! They broke our poor goblins! How- Gally, we've talked about this. No more pets until- 
Until I stop murder. I just want to play. Not my fault they're all so squishy. <laughs> and that's why we can't... Don't let your guard down. I don't trust this. Are you kidding? Time to have fun. This is impossible. This isn't working. I'll bring them back to the present. After that, you use your water skill, and I'll try sending them to the future again. This again? Have it your way. Careful. They did something to our shield. Some stupid rust. <laughs> Who cares? Enough. The Empress will want to hear of this. Ugh, fine! Crispel? Is that you? You did it! We can't thank you enough! Anton, now do you see? Look what you've done. What I've done? You think I brought these monsters to Nareem? I know this was your way of getting the farm. You wanted this land for your industrialization project. This was all you. Everything I do is for the future of Nareem. For your daughter's future. I would never put anyone at risk. Mayor Anton, if I may divert our focus, this was clearly set up by an unknown party. And on that topic, tell me, Crispel, where did you get that strange sword? Miss Lana, this was a gift from Mr. Wilhelm and Matthias. Oh, and who are these strangers you seem to know so well? What do they want with Nareem? Is it possible? Did they set this up? And are you part of their scheme? Miss Lana, no. We were just trying to help. Enough! Guards, seize her and the shielded fellow. We'll lock them up until we can extract a confession. We have to go. Now! To the cathedral. Wilhelm said he'd meet us there. Oh. 
You made it. You really were able to wield that sword. Well done. And, as promised, your friends are here. In fact, your mother superior... Crisbell! Is that you? Oh, thank the lady. Mother Superior, I'm so sorry. Shh, dear. Your interesting new friend here has told us a great deal already. I won't claim to understand all of this, but you're safe. That's safe. Maybe for now. She won't stop with Marie. The Empress will keep building up her armies. That monster won't let anything stop her. The Empress? The Empress of Time. A formidable foe, and far beyond our current capabilities. And those idiots in town are too busy pointing fingers to see who saved their worthless skins. Run from her if you want. I'll go myself if I... Enough! Don't be stupid, boy. You'll need all the help you can get. Which means, I suppose, that I'll be going as well. Going? I can't leave! The orphanage! My family! No harm will come to your sisters, dear. Not while I live. Do you see the three faces of the lady? Portrayed in the cathedral's stained glass? Those images foretell a prophecy. A legend which has been safeguarded through the ages. The lady spoke of a girl that would open time itself. A girl that would be able to see into our past, as well as... I believe that girl is you, my sweet Crisbell. But I'm no one special. I... I... You are special, my dear. More than you could possibly know. Go to the cathedrals and seek out the other mother's superior. They will... I know you've always wanted to find your mother, to learn more about your history. Perhaps this is your chance. Your grandmother often spoke of Crystallis. Perhaps the answer lies there. Matthias? Where did he go? He's slippery, that one. Even for a frog. He'll turn up soon. Count on it. The soldiers will be here soon. Quickly, girl! I... Fine. I'll go. But I'll return. I promise. You'd better. Those roses still need pruning. Don't think I've forgotten. Now get moving. Merciful lady, watch over my Crisbell. Guide her, shield her, comfort her, for she has a long road ahead. And when she is finished, O oh great lady, take her gently in your arms. And bear her home. Be safe, dear girl. There's another cathedral in St. Clarity. Perhaps we should try going there next. Just like this one. It's watched over by one of the Mother's Superior. It has another of those stained glass murals as well. Perhaps there's some connection with your powers. Same clarity, huh? I guess I knew this day was coming. The path to get there is through the forest east of my house. Let's get moving. We have to run away for now. The path east of Wilhelm's house is our escape route. to run away
it would appear we got rid of our pursuers. Perhaps we can set up camp here tonight and recover our strength. Marvelous teamwork, everyone! We didn't need to run. I could have defeated them all if the rest of you hadn't stopped me. I mean, I... Uh, what's wrong with Chris Bell? I'm tired and I feel strange. I don't know anything about my family, or my history, or my power, or... or any of it. And now I've left all my friends and... Christopher, wasn't it? Her whole life was just turned upside down. So maybe we should just let her be. Chris Bell, I know you want to help everyone back home. But to do that, you and I are going to have to develop your powers. How's a kid like you gonna teach her anything? Wilhelm had the courage to help us escape. We owe him our thanks. You will find it to be a great mistake to judge a mage by his appearance. But for right now, we need to rest. We will have plenty of new problems to face in the morning. Yes. Why did you leave St. Clarity? I... I wanted to avenge my brother, Aiden. He died in the fight against the Empress. I promised myself that, just like him, I wouldn't let anyone else die. I had been searching around, looking for clues. One of them led me to Narim. Some goblins had been sighted near here, and I knew from experience they were part of the Empress's army. I decided to take care of them myself. Aiden was my hero. But he got caught up in this stupid conflict. Sometimes I wonder if by fighting back I'm just prolonging the war and helping to create more tragedies like him. I'm... I'm sorry to hear that. Yes. Aren't you nervous? Why should I be? And did you see how we combined our magic when we rusted that giant shield? Maybe this is destiny. Now I'm actually really glad I spent all that time learning magic with my mom. Did you have a relative who taught you? No, I was actually in an orphanage until... Well, everything happened so fast. Chris Bell, there's something important I need to teach you about. What is it, Professor? Professor? Don't call me that. How about teacher? Master? Master? No! Just call me Wilhelm. I can't do that. It feels too weird calling my magic teacher by his first name. It seems somehow disrespectful. Well, if you must call me something, call me... Maestro, I suppose. I am something of a virtuoso when it comes to time magic. Maestro? If you must. Well, anyway, I want you to have these. Seeds? Are these like the seeds we planted before? They're much more important. Time mages can use them to revert to an earlier state when things go wrong. It's a little hard to explain, but you'll understand it when you see it. Okay, I'll take your word for it, maestro. Right. You'll be glad you did. Trust me. You can try it out on that patch of dirt over there. Wait! I almost forgot! Marbles? You'll need to purchase supplies. I believe we can trust you with our funds. And last, but... I trust you'll be careful on this journey. But if things go awry, don't hesitate to use one of these. What should I do? I want to record our progress. Yes, Chris Bell? Do you think the people of Nareem are okay? The town's value is in its people. I'm sure even the mayor knows that. I don't know how long it might take, but we'll be back. We'll help them. Just be patient. Yes, Chris Bell? Why are we going to St. Clarity? Because there's a famous cathedral there. 
The cathedral in Nareem was where your powers first manifested. I suspect the stained glass murals within might be connected to your powers. There are five major cathedrals. It is said that the time mages of old would go on a pilgrimage to visit all of them. Perhaps we should try to do the same. Do you think if I learn more about my powers, I can find out who my parents are? It is possible. Normally, time mages can't see their own past. But... I don't know what the limits of your powers are. And there are places in the world where normal rules do not apply. Yes, Crispell? Can I be a time mage like you? Asking to be like me is a big request. But you've got the talent, and I will mentor you. Do you ever feel scared? Fear doesn't help a time mage. I'll make sure to teach you courage as well as magic. And your new friends here, they might be useful at some point as well. Ready to sleep now, Chris Bell? In a moment. What should I do? I want to record our progress. 